And I'm Nathan Bragg, and we're live at the 2012 Vancouver Invitational Wheelchair Rugby Tournament. What we're going to be talking about today is the unsung heroes of wheelchair rugby. These are the people that help make this tournament and this sport happen. They're the people that won't get the press and that you won't hear about too much, but they're integral to their team's success. I'm talking about, of course, the equipment managers, the volunteers, the coaches, and as much as everybody might not like them, the referees. Mel's one of our many volunteers who have donated their time to help our athletes and help make this tournament a success. So what are you doing at the uh, Invitational this year? This year my responsibility was foods. Oh, so I am bringing all the nutritional sandwiches for the athletes and other guests that are here. Uh, so have you, what, do you, what do you enjoy most about rugby and uh, what makes you want to continue volunteering? Um, I feel that the rugby group is really like a family. People always are super friendly, remember me, say hi to me. And BC Village for Sports at large is really welcoming, so it keeps me coming, right. helping out. And yeah. are you planning on uh, coming out to the Canada Cup later this summer? I will be at the Canada Cup. You I'm not doing Canada foods. Cup. I'm doing something different. All right, that's top awesome. secret, but doing something different. <laughs> All right, you, hear, you heard it here first, uh, top secret volunteers. I'm here with Bob Hirschfield, who's the equipment manager for Team Canada. All right, Bob. Um, what is the role of the equipment manager in wheelchair rugby, and how important would you say that job is? Well, the role is to uh, repair basically flat tires because of the contact. Uh, and it's really important because you only have a minute, if there's a, a chair breakdown on the court, you only have a minute to repair it so that the player can continue the play. If you can't repair that in a minute, the player has to come off the court. Now, many athletes have said that they consider their equipment managers a, a key part of their team and almost like an extra team member. Would you agree with that statement? I try to, yeah. I try to keep the guys loose and uh, have fun with them and when things get serious oh, no. and, and oh, cheer no. them. And See, you guys are yelling for me right now. So what was it that got you involved with wheelchair rugby? Uh, my son Trevor, when he got uh, interested in playing and... Uh, I came out, watched, and helped, and uh, just led from one thing to another. So how does it feel to be the equipment manager on the team that your son is a part of and going to the Olympics and uh, World Championships? Pretty exciting. Uh, I did, wasn't with the team in Beijing. Trevor was uh, on the court for uh, the bronze medal. Uh, this year I get to go out uh, with the team, so I'm hoping we go for gold this year. What are you most looking forward to at the uh, 2012 Canada Cup, which will be right here in British Columbia? Ah, for a good competition, uh, like the, the World Cup that we had here uh, two year and a half ago. Uh, hopefully I'd like to see a lot of fans come out and watch. It really uh, helps the players get involved, and uh, they like it when there's a lot of people cheering. Today I'm here with uh, Kevin Kirkup, the head coach of the Saskatchewan wheelchair rugby team. So, Kevin, how did you get involved with wheelchair rugby? Um, I got involved basically uh, by, uh, well, just being in, around the disabled community, playing wheelchair basketball. Um, a bunch of the rugby guys asked me to kind of help out with uh, planning their practices and uh, kind of doing some bench management, and that's how I got started. All right, so what are some of your uh, coaching highlights so far in this young coaching career of yours? Uh, well, last year uh, we finished second in the B division. Um, we've won the... Uh, Two years in a row, we've won the uh, Edmonton Invitational Tournament. Um, past that, uh, you know, nothing but uh, nothing but going up. That's what we're looking for. So, uh, what's your goal with Team Saskatchewan this weekend, and how are you helping your athletes prepare for nationals uh, next month? Well, um, basically, for expectations for this weekend. I mean, we're just looking to play as best we can. We got a few people that are down uh, with injuries, um, but uh, basically, uh, play strong all the time, not give up. And then, I mean, just kind of work towards nationals, uh, seeing what works and what doesn't against the teams that we're going to see there. All right, so thanks a lot. We're here with uh, Kevin Kirkup, head coach of Saskatchewan's wheelchair rugby team, uh, at the Vancouver Invitational, which is the final tournament before Canadian nationals in Canada. So this was a great tune-up tournament, and this has been a great segment.